final lap with Kerry Murphy. The NASCAR All-Star Race went down over the weekend, and first up was the showdown qualifying event, where David Reagan wins from the pole after a late race pass on Brad Keselowski, who also advanced. As expected, Dale Earnhardt Jr. was the fan voted in driver. Now on to the All-Star Race itself. Here we go, 5-1. to one. Greg Biffle, Tony Stewart, David Rudiman, number 3, and Kyle Busch with his best All-Star Race finish, pockets $258,000, but just misses the trophy. Heading to victory lane now where Carl Edwards wins the All-Star Race and takes home over $1.2 million total prize money, including all of his segment wins. Yeah, I don't think it's sunk in yet. Um, I'm really excited to be able to uh, to get on the phone and, uh, and call some of my close friends and talk to them about it. If we wouldn't have come off pit road first, it would have been a very difficult race. You know, I, it took me about 10 laps or so to get by Kyle and those guys, so it, it would have been uh, would have been a very tough race. So those guys... They get a lot of credit for this win. Then Carl completely totaled his race car in the infield grass trying to celebrate. So Carl, in effect, took checkers and wreckers. You guys know, I mean, I usually just pull down there, do a backflip. I thought, hey, I'm going to do a little, you know, slide to the grass. This will be great. And as soon as I turned to the grass, I found the, um, it just dug in the splitter. And um, I didn't expect that. So Bob's been doing a really good job of keeping the splitter down. It helps on the racetrack and it doesn't help in the grass. I guess that's the bottom line. (laughs) Check us out at twitter.com slash the final lap.